Hey guys, what's up? It's Phil, and welcome back to another super exciting episode of Super Mario 64 playing on the Nintendo Switch. Now, in the last episode, we had covered Cool Cool Mountain and also covered the Wing Cap Power Up uh, and got the eight red coins in there as well. So, so far, we've done Bomb on Battlefield, Womp's Fortress, Cool Cool Mountain, and we've got one of the secret stars, uh, Castle Secret Stars. So, we're actually going to grab probably about three secret stars right now. So we're going to run over here to uh, this door, and this is going to be Peach's Slide, I believe is what it's called. And we are going to... Uh, first of all, there's there's two different stars that you can get on this level, so let's just run down through here and I'll talk as I'm going. So, if you are able to complete the slide in under 20 seconds, then you'll get a star for that. So, let's just blast right through it. And you don't really have to do any kind of shortcuts or anything. You do want to, like, hug the corners very tightly and be kind of quick with it. Oh, is that... Maybe it's under 21 seconds. You can get a, a star. And then the other secret star is actually right behind us. So that was one of the castle secret stars. And like I said, I believe it's under... I thought it was under 20 seconds. Maybe it's under 21 seconds. And so then all we have to do is uh, jump back in and grab grab the other one at the very bottom. And we don't have to worry about any kind of timing or anything like that. We can just blast right through this um, as fast or as slow as we want to. But we'll get a star just basically for completing it. I may actually get the star to, the star again. Yep. <laughs> so don't grab that star, because then it'll just teleport you back and you have to do it again. There we go. So that is Castle Secret Star number two of this episode. And then there's one more that we've got to, that we can grab before we actually go into the actual um, level. So we're going to go in here. This is Dire Dire Docks. And if you go to the left right here, you'll see that there is a black box. You can actually backflip up here if I can land it. And you can get a, a one-up. But if you go to the opposite side, there's another one. And this was actually a secret level. So what you can do in here is grab all of the eight red coins. Uh, there should be four up top and four at the bottom. And you can actually uh, you know, practice your swimming. Now in order to swim in Super Mario 64, you can actually, if you pre you can just smash the button as many times as you want. Um, as fast as you want and it'll kind of like swim fast somewhat you can hold it down and he'll do like a little foot kick like this but if you get it at a rhythm you'll start to hear a sound and you'll notice that you'll swim a whole lot faster and so um, you just have to kind of practice that you get the hang of it and then once we collect the eighth coin the star will appear in the center in the middle there we go one of the secret stars. Now the reason I was kind of talking about how you should swim like optimally, you'll find out in just uh, in just a little bit with the pain that we're about to go through in one of these next uh, stars. <laughs> you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. All right, so here is where the where the Dire Dire Docks starts. Oh no, I'm sorry, this is Jolly Roger Bay. I was calling it Dire Dire Docks. That's one that's a little bit later. So plunder in the sunken ship. So this one's pretty easy. Gosh, I'm sorry guys. I was totally calling it the wrong level. I was getting ahead of myself. So in this particular star, we're just going to swim down to the bottom. And there's a gigantic ship. And then there's a gigantic eel as well. So all I have to do is lure him out and there'll be a star. So if you kind of swim around him, swim swim underneath, and then like head back to the top is what I usually do. 
typically grab some air and typically he'll sh he'll show up he'll come out yeah there he goes cool so then once he's out of that hole in the ship then you can go into that into that hole if I can get my camera angled correctly and here's where we can grab um, the power star so there's some treasure chests, and I can't remember what order it's in, so I'm probably going to get shocked. But I think it's left, right, middle, middle? Nope. <laughs> Let's try this one over here. Maybe it's right, left, first. Nope. I'm about to die, guys. Is it this one? Oh, my. Totally lost it. It's been a little bit. It's been a little while since I've actually um, played this this level. All right, let's try it again. Legit just died on camera in front of everybody. It's, it's embarrassing, Phil. What are you trying to do? Okay, so we're going to jump back down here we're gonna swim underneath is what I usually do I think you can as long as you like get out of the way he'll come out but I usually just swim back up here just out of habit and grab some air and then by that time he is well out of the way here we go and let's try this again shall we so obviously it was none of the three that I tried it was the, the first one so maybe what I was thinking was it's this it's this back one first and then maybe it's left right middle from there so maybe maybe that's what I was thinking yeah I bet you that's what it is it's just been a little bit since I've done this I mean the game is like 35 years old so bear with me okay <laughs> Not really. It's uh, 96. You can do the math. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. Grab it. Yes. It's really annoying to try to get up the side of that the ship uh, if you don't make it in time. You'll have to climb all the way up, and it's just so annoying. So if you can swim fast enough, get to the top and grab that star. Alright, so let's jump back in. We're going to grab seven power stars from this level, too. So, can the eel come out to play? So this is a different eel. Or maybe it's the same eel, but just in a different spot. But basically, all you have to do is, well, well I'll show you. So now we've got a ship that's floating. And the eel is now hiding again. And what we'll do is we'll come right on the top. Kind of where he's at. He's going to come out try to bite us and we're going to not get bit and the camera is awful oh my gosh I can't see a thing there he goes well I didn't really get to do the trick that I wanted to but basically all you need to do is grab the star oh. come on Mario go get some coins 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 Whew. let me go grab some air get some more health totally didn't get to do the trick that I wanted to do but basically if you just wait until he comes out then you can just swim right down and grab the star as soon as he comes out but not today Phil not today so where did he go where is he at oh okay so we get to try it again so I, I can show you the little trick then that's cool the camera on this is not cooperating oh my gosh here we go. It's still not quite the camera angle that I was hoping for, but it works. Okay, you get the idea. If you if you hang out right there, as soon as he comes out, you can grab that star really easy. Alrighty. 27 power stars already. That's pretty cool. Alright, treasure in the ocean cave. Here's some more of those shocking chests that I'll probably uh, die on again, but we'll we'll try not to die this time. All right, 
So now the creepy eel is out for good. He's going to be swimming around trying to freak us out as we play this level. But he won't come after you. He'll just swim around. And we're going to make our way up to this little area where we grabbed some air before. And we're going to try not to get hit by this thing right here. And then there's a bunch more that we have to try not to get hit by. So if you just kind of maneuver yourself, you can kind of dodge and not get hit. All right, so gosh, I cannot remember at all. But I think this first one in the front is last. Maybe, I wonder if it's the same as, as the ship. Yeah. Well, it's not quite the same. It's a little backwards, but either way, it's back, left, right, front. And there's... That was a super easy power star. I'm not going to lie. That was super easy. Treasure of the Ocean Cave. Done and done. So what's the next one? Jolly Roger Bay, red coins on the ship afloat. Okay, so as you probably guessed it, we're going to be looking for 100 coins as well as the 8 red coins. So we're going to go through and grab every single coin that we can. And I'm going to first go kind of... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I was trying to do a long jump. Oh well. Well, since I'm in the water, I'll go over here and get the coins that are surrounding this little pillar. Because I always forget them when I'm doing the 100 coins on this level, so I'll get them first. And then I'm going to turn around, because <laughs> you missed one. And then I'm going to go down here and grab some 8 red coins. Man, my camera is so frustrating sometimes on this game. Okay, so there should be some eight, some red coins somewhere. Yep, there's one. I don't remember... Oh, there's a shell in that one. We can grab that if we want. I don't really think I'll need it, though. But maybe I'll grab it just for... Just for fun. Helps you swim a little faster, I guess. I knew that was going to happen. That's why I never really grabbed it, because I have to go get the, eight, the the red coin, and I always explode the shell on, on that clam. I'm going to get smashed. Okay, almost got smashed. I didn't get smashed, though. Alright, so we're going to not get stuck there. Oh, there's some coins. Jump down. Okay, so we are at 30 coins so far. I think there's a there's a red coin, yep, right here. And uh, you know what? Since I'm here, I'm gonna go ahead and talk to this dude and get the cannon going. We're gonna need that in the in just a minute when we go to get another star. So we're already here. Why not? All right, so we'll jump right over here and keep going. Come on. There we go. So there should be some... Yep, yeah, a bunch of coins right here. And then there's some red coins over on the ship. So that will help. If I can get my camera correct, I can not fall off. Alright, so we've got what? One, two, three, four. Yeah, we can go ahead and do a long jump. Grab that one. Oh. Well, I was going to try to triple jump on top of that, but didn't work. All right, so the so the red coin star is actually going to spawn right here. So we're going to keep going. And we're going to grab some more coins. So there's there's one down there in one of the clams. So we'll grab that one. Oh, wow. The depth perception right there was terrible. I didn't think that I was even close. Better go over here and get some coins, get some health. 
All right, got it. So let's go over here, get this red coin. Then that, that star is gonna spawn on top of the ship. So that's cool. That'll be up there when we're ready. And we've got mm, about 40 coins to go, so we're, we're making good progress. So I think what we can do is head over to the cave, the treasure cave where we just were um, on the last Power Star. And we can actually, there to the right here, there's a little switch that we can hit to release some blue coins, which will give us five per... Oh, watch out. Will give us five per uh, coin. So... But stop that, that'll be 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Wow. We just got a few more to go. Let's get these guys. Got him. Got him. I love diving into these guys. So much fun. Alright, let's. I think there's some over here in the corner, so we'll grab these and we'll be on our way. Look at this. 100 coins, guys. Boom. Here we go. You know, that went a lot faster than snow, than snow, snowy mountain. Uh, gosh, that took forever. I kept falling off the side and couldn't, couldn't land it. On one of our previous episodes. I was trying to go over after the wall kicks and it just, wow, it just took forever. All right, so let's go up to the ship. Make our way up there, and we'll grab that star, and that will complete two stars with one run. Super efficient. Oh, I was trying to do a that. There we go. All right, so let's do... If I can line this up, I should be able to just long jump. Yep, there we go. Two, three. There we go. Triple jump. Give me that star. And we're done with that level. <clears throat> Red coins on the ship afloat with 100 coins even. Boom. 30 power stars, guys. All right, so you've, re you've recovered 30 power stars. Now you can open the door with the big star. But before, be but before you move on, how's it going otherwise? Did you pound the two columns down? You didn't lose your hat, did you? If you did, you'll have to stomp on the condor to get it back. Wow, so they're like... They're thinking that we're uh, way far ahead in, in the basement levels, and we're, we're nowhere near that because we're collecting so many stars. So, blast to the stone pillar. So this is why I unlocked the cannon. Where did it go? There it is. Because we can jump right here. And we're going to blast to this little stone pillar. we got to blast to the top of the pillar because if we blast too far down, he won't grab onto it. So, got to grab the top. And then if you move your camera around, you can kind of position him. Wow, this camera is so bad. To where you'll land. Right there. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Sometimes the camera will mess up and you'll end up landing in the water, which is kind of annoying, but hey, we did it that time, so it's all good. Blasted the stone pillar, so I think, is there one more? I, did, I didn't count last time. Yeah, there's one more. Through the jet stream. How could I forget? Okay, so remember where I was telling you earlier uh, when we were getting one of the secret stars that you're going to want to know how to swim <laughs> and swim really well. And that is for this particular star. This one is tough. I'm not going to lie. You don't have to do it this way. I'm going to do it this way, though, so that we can keep our episodes uh, a lot more clean. So that you can basically just uh, watch one episode and see where all the stars and how to get all the stars. So the same thing applies here. Um, kind of like in the... Let me, get some, let me get some more air. But kind of the same way on the first level, how we tried to get one of the power stars without getting the wing cap so we're gonna do that here we're gonna do this without getting metal Mario because normally you could if you got metal Mario you could just knock this out easy but we're gonna do it the hard way oh I was so there I was so there so this is gonna take a second I'm not gonna lie 
This is going to take a couple tries because the jet stream pushes you left and right, up and down, and it's really tough. But it's doable. It's doable. I promise. I may have to go get some air. Come on. Oh, I'm right there. I'm right there. Oh, I was so there. I was so there. I was like touching the corner of the star. Alright, so let's go get some air and we'll try it again. It's really tough. I mean, it's a super, it's a super big challenge, but if you can do it, I mean, you got some bragging rights, right? I mean, you tell everybody you did it. But it's super tough. Not gonna lie. I used to not. Oh, there we go. Got it. Boom. I used to not do it that way, but uh, once I figured out that I could do it, I was just like, Psh, I'm not gonna go get the metal cap and worry about all that, and then come back and do, you know. So anyways, that will complete that level. That is seven stars in the correct level name. is called Jolly Roger Bay. I was calling it Dire Dire Doc because I, I don't know what I was thinking. Jolly Roger Bay is complete. We've got seven stars there. We've got Cool Cool Mountain. Uh, we've got Womp's Fortress and Bomb Bomb Battlefield, which equals, with all the uh, secret stars included, we've got 32 power stars. Wow, we are moving right along in this game. So that will complete this episode. Be sure to stay tuned for the next episode coming right up.